Hey you guys, Misty here today and I'm showing you guys everything that I've colored for the month of January 2021. I've got a big stack of books. So let's get started. Um, the first one is Puzzle Animals Color by Colors Kyra Shershaneva and I did several in here. I did this one right here. I used um, Arteza Everblend markers and Kelly Art markers on the draft. This was really fun to do. I enjoyed it. I I'm sorry about the glare. Is the the paper so pretty and shiny and it just puts off a glare? Also, I did this one right here, and I used Arteza Everblend markers and Kelly Art markers on this one. And I did the cat one. I used um, Arteza Everblend markers and Kelly Art markers. And the date I did these, the draft I did, did it January the 20th? I did, I, believe, I did all these the same day. So all three pictures was done um, January the 29th, 2021. So when I did all three pictures. So there's that book right there. Alright, the next book we have is Flower Animals, One Color Coloring Book by Sunlight Drawing. Um, I did two in this book. I get, let's see here. Okay, hold on just a second. Let me go back here. I did. I got them tagged, they're still hard to find. I did this one right here, and I used um, dual tip design markers by Nicole for this one, and I did this one um, January the 24th, 2021, and also the other picture I did the same day too, so there's this one right here. And I did this one back here also. I did this one right here. And I used the old tilt design markers by Nicole also for this one. Uh, next book we have, I did quite a few in here, is Three Color Series by Belba Family. And the first one I did was Marilyn Monroe. I did this one right here, and I used, um, let's see here, I used Crayola Super Tips. Yep, I used uh, Crayola Super Tips on her, all Crayola Super Tips. I like how she turned out the colors I used. And this one I did January 27, 2021. And right here is the colors I put together for the picture. And also I did Elton John. And I used um, the Dill Tip Design Markers by Nicole for this one. I did this picture January 24, 2021. So I did this one. And this one right here, I used Crayola Super Tips on. And I did this one January the 7th, 2021. So I did this one. I'll be doing more in here too. Uh, this is one I did of Michael Jackson. And I used the Corolla Super Tips on this one. And uh, this one I completed January the 6th, 2021. I about messed up on the skin to start with. I was using light peach. 
and then I thought no I better not do that so I tried to stick with a lighter brown color for his skin even though he changed his color you know still we I decided to go with that and I love this one right here I did this one Whitney Houston I use Crayola Super Tips here's the three colors I used on here these I was just sampling out but these three I do believe well there's no telling it's some of these colors right here I used I did this one January the 7th 2021 so I did this one and This one I did of Whoopi Goldberg. I also used Crayola Super Tips on her. January the 22nd. No. January the 23rd, 2021 is when I did this one. I like how she turned out. She turned out really good. I did this one right here. Used Crayola Super Tips on Nicole Kentman. I did this one January the 9th, 2021. And the last one I did in here was Johnny Depp. I did this one with Dual Temp Design Markers by Nicole. And I completed this on January the 6th, 2021. So when I did this one. Really fun to do. This was the first one I did in the book when I got it. Uh, next we have the 50 Spring Miniatures by Camila Andrakova. From the paper here. Okay. Colored the bicycle. What a sparkle there. I used um, Chromatech gel pens on this. And I did this one January 13, 2021, is when I did this one. The next one I did is this one right here. And it was a color along with Rian. And I used Rian glitter gel pens. And a glitter marker. And this I'm used to, Right in here is where I used the glitter marker. And then right here I used the marker. I can't remember which marker I used. And I used the uh, Rian glitter gel pens. That's on the shiny item there. Really fun to do. I enjoyed this one. I did this one. Um, January 23rd, 2021. So I did that one. And I did the B one. This was fun to do also. I used Chromatech gel pens on this one. And this one I did. January 13th, 2021. All three of those pictures are really fun to do. I really have fun doing those. Uh, next we have the Gothic Tattoos by Jade Summer. I did two in here. This is a really nice book. I used the, um, I used the spray markers on this picture right here. And I used Faber Castell pencil to go over the skin. Also, I went over everything else using um, Arteza pencils. So I went over the skin with Faber Castell and then everything else I went over with Arteza pencil. And I did this on January 14, 2021. So I did this one. Now we got this one right here. Okay, I did this one. I did this one right here using the Chromatech. It looks like 
I know I didn't use the Chromatech gel. Okay, let me see. Hold on now. Uh, Sometimes or another, I always get confused. I use spray markers on it. On this one. We'll try not to get too confused here. Uh, this one I did January 14th, 2021. Is when I did this one. See how the octopus has a face like a skull there. That was fun. Next, we have 50 Summer Miniatures by Camellia Angelkova. And I did two in here. I did this one right here. The cute little frogs. It's real sparkly. I used, um, all right, we're in the summertime one. I used colored glitter gel pens and folk art paint. And also, yeah, that's it right there color it glitter gel pens and folk art paint on this, uh, paint on this picture a lot of sparkle and I did this one um, January 13, 2021 is when I did this one and also we did this one right here I really love doing this one the little grasshopper it was really fun to do I used, okay, I used gl color glitter gel pens on this picture right here. All gel pen. And I did this one January 13th, 2021 is when I did that one. That was fun to do. And next we have the 50 Springtime Mandalas by Camila mm. and Jacoba. I did two in here. I was trying to stick to the color and the eggs. I decided to leave the background white here because the design was so pretty. So I decided to stick to white for background. And I used uh, Chromatech gel pens for this picture right here. A lot of sparkle. Real pretty and shiny. I did this one. Um... January 14th, 2021 is when I did that one. I did this one right here also. I used um, Chromatech gel pens for this one too. All Chromatech pens. And I decided to color the egg purple on that one. What are you doing, Casper? And I did that one. Um, January 14th, 2021 is when I did that one. It's fun to do. Uh, next we have One Color Arts, Birds and Flowers with Sun Life Drawing. I did one in here. Let's see. Which one did I do? I did this one right here. And I used uh, Rion Glitter Gel pens on this one. All same color. I like how this one turned out. I did this one January 22nd, 2021 is when I did this one. And you know I had to work in Belba family. I love Belba family. I worked in the pa Party Patterns book. And... We did two. I did two in here. I did this one right here, January twenty first, twenty twenty one. This one was uh, this one was New Year's. I used the X method. I used uh, Crayola Super Tips and Arteza Everbloom markers on this. Really fun to do. And I did the heart one for Valentine's Day, January the 21st, 2021. Also used our uh, uh, Crayola Super Tips and Arteza Everly markers on this one, January 21st. That's all I done in that one. Next we have uh, Mermaid Hair by Deborah Moeller. I did one in here. I did this one right here. 
and it's a color along with Brooke. Um, I started out coloring her skin the right color I wanted was like a lighter green. And then I seen where some of the marker had a streak. So I ended up making it worse because I got a darker green color I didn't like. So then I went over it with um, the Crayola glitter marker to try to fix it better. And it worked. Her her face is real shiny, but you can't you can't tell that she had the light green skin, and it it looked good with the light green. I just messed it up when I went over it with the dark. I used Jelly Roll Moonlight Sparkle Pop Crayola glitter marker. That's what I used on this one right here. I like how she turned out though. I wasn't sure, like I said, how it was gonna go, but anytime you mess up with the marker, um. One of those glitter markers will definitely save it. Just keep that in mind. You can get some of those glitter markers and it does help. I did this one January the 17th, 2021 is when I did this one. And also Brooks was really nice too. She colored with me. I'll put her um, Instagram page on, on my video here below so you can see where her page is. Next, we have the uh, Macrons uh, by, let's see here, by Carla Magana Macrons. Did this one right here as the color along with um, Jackie Tangerines, her name on Instagram, and her name's Heather. She's really nice, and it's my new col she's my new coloring friend, and we had fun on this. She done a good one, too. And on this, I used uh, Extra Sparkle Glitter Gel Pens Flare and BH Cosmetics Eyeshadow and Blush for the background on this picture. She's real sparkly. I did this one um, January 21st, 2021 is when I did this one. And next we have the, um, next we've got the Wee Wickets by Carla Magana. So I did one in here. Also, this was a color along with, uh, Heather Junkie Tangerine on Instagram. And I used, um, I used Rion Glitter Gel Pens on this one. That's all I used. So it's real shiny. I did this one um, January 21st, 2021. So when I did this one. Uh, next we have The Lovely Angels by Juliana Emerson. I did two in here. I did this one right here. I like how she turned out. I used... Um, Kelly Art Markers for her. All Kelly Arts. I did that one um, January 12th, 2021. Did this one also. Um, for this one, I used Kelly Art Markers, Rion Glitter, Gel Pens, and Sparkle Pop. You can tell where the sparkle is, where the sparkle's on it. I used the sparkle pop on her wings. Mostly on her wings, I believe. I did that one uh, January the 12th, 2021 is when I did this one. Did I do any more in here? That's all. Okay, I'll take this tag out. I forgot to take it out. Tag. Now, next we got the Mouse Family. Cute and, and Crazy Critter Village. The Mouse Family, Volume 1 by Vern Brown. I did one in here. I did this one. No, I did two. Okay, that's right. I did two in here. I did this one right here. I did this one. I used spray markers on this picture right here. 
and I did that one January the 15th, 20, that's where I need to change that, because I put 2020, I need to put 2021 there, let me find my pencil, and I'll change that, I got my pencil, yeah, I got my pencil close, see, I'm going to get used to writing 2021 now, 2021, And I did this one here also. Let me put my little slips over here. Right here. I used uh, Deal Tilt Design Marker by Nicole and Sparkle Pop on this one. The Sparkle Pop was really fun to do. I decided to go with the Sparkle Pop. Then I did this one, January 16th, 2021. This was fun. Now, let's see here. Okay, next we've got uh, 50 Romantic Mandalas and Heart Designs by Camille and Jacob. I did two in here. I really love this one. I used uh, Chromatech, Chromatech Gel Pens, Sparkle Pop, Milky Pop, and Solar Pop on this one. It looks, it reminds me of one of those heart candy wrappers that you get with all the sparkle. I really like it though. It turned out good. And I did this one, um, January 15th, 2021 is when I did this one. And also I did this picture right here. And I used spree markers on this picture. And I did this one, January 15th, 2021. So I did this one. Uh, next we have the uh, Stone Mosaic Book 1 by Belva Family. I did the last page. And I used Crayola Super Tips and Arteza Everbloom Marker on this picture. That I was really excited because this was the first one I did because I decided to buy both of these mosaic, stone mosaic books. So it was really fun to do. I enjoyed doing it. Uh, January the 28th, 2021 is when I did this one. And they don't take, they don't take long to do actually. They're just nice and relaxing to sit down and do. So I definitely recommend these books and next we have the um secret village by ava brown I did three in here i did this one first and i used the spray markers on this one and i did this one um january 26 2021 that's when i did this one This one right here, also use the spray markers on this one. I really enjoyed doing this one. Uh, January 27th, 2021. So I did this one with the cute little mice. January 27th, yep. And I did this one too. I did this one right here with the rabbit. I colored it with spray markers. Um, January 27th, 2021. Right, next we have the Cozy Cabins by Eva Brown. I did several in here. I did this one first. I really love doing this. I loved it. So fun to do. I used spree markers and dual tip design markers by Nicole on this picture. And I did this one January 27th, 2021 is when I did this one. 
and here's another one I did. Okay, right here the cat. I used um, spray markers and dual temp design markers by Nicole on this one also. I did this one um, January 27, 2021. And I did this one right here. Also used the same thing, spray markers, dual temp design markers by Nicole on this one. I really love it. It was so fun to color. I did this one um, January 28, 2021. So I did this one. Uh, next, we had the Space Girls and Aliens by um, Deborah Muller. I did several in here. I, this one right here was a color along with Haley. And I used my Spectrum Noir markers for the first time that, on this picture. And it was really fun to do. I really enjoyed it. That yellow is really excellent. So I definitely like this one, how she turned out. And I did this one. Um, of course, I didn't write down the date. There's one I use the miss, guys, that I forget to write down what day it is. But I did do it. I did color it last month. Yep. I did color it last month. I did this one right here with Haley. And I used free markers on her. All spray markers. Uh, January the 8th, 2021 is when I did this one. And did one more in here. I did this one right here. This was a color along with Brooke. And uh, for this one, I used um, spray markers, dual temp. Design markers by Nicole and a glitter marker. And that's all I used. <clears throat> I messed up her skin and I saved it with the glitter marker is what happened. But I think she turned out okay in the long run. Her skin's pretty and shiny. I did this one uh, January 28, 2021 is when I did this one. Next we have uh, Love and Hearts by Ava Brown. Let's go back to here first. Cause I did this one right here first. Um, let's see. I wrote it down. Uh, spray markers. Use spray markers on this one right here. And I did that one January the 20th, 2021 is when I did that one. And I have one more here. And I did this one on chat. And I used all extra sparkle glitter gel pens flare on this picture. And I like how it turned out. There's a lot of sparkle and shine. It's the first time I ever tried out those pens. And they're pretty good. So I highly recommend them. They give a lot of glitter shine. I did this one January 19th, 2021. Next, we have my Gothic Valentine by Deborah Muller. I did several in here. I did this one right here. And I used Dual Tip Design Marker by Nicole on this one. I like how she turned out. She was fun to color, too. I really had fun coloring this picture. And I did this one um, January 19, 2021. And this one right here I colored using dual tip design markers by Nicole on this one also. I like the way she turned out. That was really fun to color. 
True Love Chocolate is what it says on the heart there. And I did this one um, January 18th, 2021 is when I did this one. And then I did this one last in here in in this book for the month of January. This is Color On with Brooke. And I used Dual Tip Design Marker by Nicole and White Jelly Roll. That's what I used on this one. And also we did this one on chat. And I did this one, um, January 23rd, 2021 is when I did that one. And I colored this one right here. I used Kelly Art Neon Glitter Gel Pens on this one. Really fun to do. And I did this one January the 9th, 2021. So when I did that one. And this one right here I did. I used the Rion Glitter Gel Pens on this one. And I did this one. Um, let me see here. I do it. January the 11th, 2021 is when I did this one. And this, the last one I did was this one right here. I used rayon glitter gel pens on this one. Really fun to do. Pretty and shiny. I did this one um, January 11, 2021. Show you a close up real quick of the robots. If you can see them up close. This one. Next, I did the um, Secret Life of Robots by Nola R. Hensel. I did several in here. I did this one right here. And I used Artisa. No, I used Kelly Art Markers on this one. Kelly Art Markers. I did this one January 12th, 2021. So I did this one. And did this one right here. I used Kelly Art Markers. On January the 11th, 2021. So I did this one. And then I did this one right here too. I did this one. This is really fun. I used Kelly Art markers on this one too. And I did this one uh, January 11th, 2021. So I did this one. Uh, next we have the 365 Peaceful Days to Color. And I uh, did this one right here, the very first of the month. Right here, I used uh, Rion Glitter Gel Pens on this picture, all Rion. So I plan on doing more in this book. I was going to color day by day, and then I decided not to. It would be too hard to do, so I'll just color a page here and there in the book. And this is January 1st, as when I colored it, I choose to be happy, was the saying on it. So I like how it turned out, it's real sparkly and shiny. Take my tags out. Let's see now, I just colored one in here. And then we got the, uh, Think of Something, Conspiracies, Curiosities, and Cover-Ups by Avery Neal. I did several in here. And you see how this page yellows. That's because I used Arteza Everblend markers. That's why that page is yellow like that. I'm just trying to use them up. So I used Arteza Everblend markers on this. And that's it, I believe. Yeah, just Arteza Everblend markers. They're good markers, but they just yellow the pages, you know. 
And I did this one. Um, see how it yellowed this page right here? Just so you know, it's good to know this, you know. In case you want to invest in them. This uh, picture I did January the 6th, 2021. And did this one right here, the flat earth picture. I used glitter markers, jot permanent markers, tri gel fashion gel pens, and Arteza Everblend markers on this one. So I used quite a few of this, different things. A lot of stuff I got from the Dollar Tree I used. I did that one January the 5th, 2021. And I did this one right here also. On this one, I used Dollar Tree items. Everything was Dollar Tree on this. I used glitter markers, dark permanent markers, pinned gear, 0 0.8 millimeter multicolor gel pen. I used a uh, tri gel fashion gel pen, gel B pen. And metallic marker on this. I love how it turned out. For Dollar Tree items, you can't beat it. So definitely get some Dollar Tree items and color with them. I did this one um, January 5th, 2021 is when I did that one. We've got the um, Chibi Animals by Ava Brown. Now, some of these I've got bookmarked that I plan on coloring that I haven't done. So, this one right here, I did the giraffe. I used Dual Tip Design Marker by Nicole on this one. I colored a lot this month, guys. did this one January 16, 2021. I did the owl picture. I used Dual Tip Design Marker by Nicole on this one also. And that little blue marks the little cloud. I decided to color it blue in there. I did that one uh, January 15, 2021. I did the pig one. I used um, Dual Tip Design Marker by Nicole on a cute little pig. And I used, let's see, yeah, okay, I told you what I used. January 16th, 2021 is when I did the pig picture. I think it's all of them. I'm pretty sure it is. Because the other ones I just had bookmarked that I wanted to color. So that was all of them. Next, we've got the Lovely Dresses by Ava Brown. I did this one right here. Right here, I did this one. I used uh, spray markers on her. All spray marker, all spray markers. I did that one um, January the 8th, 2021, when I did that one. I did this one right here, and I used um, spray markers and sparkle pop on the flowers on the bush there. I like the way the sparkle pop made it, you know, different looking. I did this one um, January the 8th, 2021. I did this one right here also. Use spray markers and sparkle pop on her. Like the way she turned out. And I did this one um, January the 8th, 2021. And next we've got the Misfits by Deborah Muller. So I did this one right here. With my color and friend Aubrey, Thunder Junkie. We did this one together. Mm. And I used spray markers and white Milky Pop on her. That's what I used on this one. Really fun to do. And I did this one uh, January the 8th, 2021. Is when I did that one. 
We did this one also with the Aubrey. It's called a long thunder junkie. We did this one together and I used um, spray markers and sparkle pop on her. And I and uh, did that one January the 1st, 2020s when I did that one. It's really fun. Okay, almost to the end. Next we have the uh, Classic Farm Life by Ava Brown. Did several in here. Did this one right here. And I used um, Arteza Everglade markers and gel pens on her. Nope, it doesn't look like I used uh, gel pens, so I'm just going to say, I'm just going to say Arteza Everglade markers. Unless I skipped one, I don't think I did. So I did this one right here, uh, January 3rd, 2021 is when I did this one. I don't see no gel pen on that. Okay, let's see now guys. All right, the next picture right here we did was um, with Arteza Everblen markers on this cow picture, January 2nd, 2021. And also on this one, I used Arteza Everblen markers and some gel pens for the outlines on this pretty cat picture. And see how that page yellows with the Arteza. So I might just quit using those altogether. I did that one January 2nd, 2021. You see how that page is yellow there? Luckily, Ava Brown's got duplicate pages, so that helps some um, if you've got yellow pages. This one I used um, Arteza Evelyn markers on this one too. Yep, because of that, you see that yellow page right there. But that's the way it is. At least you guys can see it, how the markers are. I wish they would fix the problem, you know? Okay, January 3rd, 2021. And then we got the Whimsy Girls Celebrate the Holidays uh, coloring book by Hannah Lynn. And there's a color along. Let me tell you what the color along is. Uh, Color and Divas hosting a year-long color along, and the hashtag is, is Whimsy Girls 2021. And also, you can hashtag her at the Color and Diva on Instagram when you color page, so she can see it. So this month we colored this picture right here. This is the New Year's picture. Colored this one, and I used Kelly Art markers. And I did that one January the 1st, 2020, 2021. Yes. And I did this one right here yesterday. I used um, Kelly Art markers on her. Really fun. Did that one January 31st, 2021. We got the Cupid Cuties by Deborah Muller. And I did this one right here. I did this one on camera on chat for you guys. And I used um, spray markers and pebble chalk on this one right here. I did this one January the 20th, 2021. So I did this one. And then we got the um, this one right here. I did this one. And I used Kelly Art markers on her. I did this one January 30th. January 30th, 2021. And the last one I have is Mystery Mosaics Gallery. And in these, I use the same things, Crayola Super Tips and um, Arteza Everglade Markers. So I did this violin one, violin and guitar, J-U-A-N-G-R-A-S, 23, and it tells the price, 2300.000 on that. 
January 25th, 2021 is when I did this one. And then this one right here I did. Right here. Brown eyes. I did brown eyes. A-L-E-X-E-J and then Vaughn and then J-A-W-L-E-N-S-K-Y. I think I just spell that. 5.500.000. And that's on the front cover, too. So I decided to do that one. January the 26th, 2021. So that's all of them. Let's see how many I did. Let's go ahead and count my slips. I think it was 80-something. Okay, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 30, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72. I counted 73 tabs, but I'll go on Instagram and just see to be sure. And it's 73 pictures to put on my title so you guys can be sure on the pictures I've done. Thank you so much for hanging in with me. And we will talk again. I love you all very much. Have a good day. Bye-bye.